Hello everyone, it's Michelle and welcome to another video. I went to Hobby Lobby yesterday and got a few things. 50% uh, off, the things I got were 50% off. You know, one week they'll have, they switch back and forth. So one week the findings and uh, jewelry shop brand and bead design company and uh, traditions I think it is. And then the next week the beads like check beads and tubed and strung beads are on sale. So this, when I went, it the beads weren't on sale. But I did get a few things and I wanted to show that I got. I didn't know they had uh, donuts, gemstone donuts. All right, so I got these for two fifty. They're um, tiger eye, tiger's eye. That and this one is Picasso 18 millimeter Picasso Jasper donuts. They're nice. I love gemstone donuts. All right, then. Hold on. Okay, my cat turned the computer on. All right, now I have buttons. I love to use buttons as clasps. And these were on sale as well, so I got this for like a dollar twenty-five. And they are metal. And I got these, which would be ear climbers. You'd wear them, you know, you'd put the ear, let's see, how would you do that? You'd have to have a post that goes through here, and then this would climb up your ear. Um, regular $3.99, I got it for a couple bucks. Let's see. I got some, I love ball head pins they make things look fancier and um, I want to make some little charms with some crystal and head pins so um, yeah these are four dollars for a pack of 20 I got it for two but I don't understand why the ball head pins are so much more expensive than the regular head pins that's a mystery to me all right I got some 12 millimeter wood rings. I love rings in my jewelry design. It poses a lot of um, options. You know, you can use them as connectors, you can beat around them, um, you can dangle them. They're pretty. I think they're pretty. Alright, and I got some more wood beads. These are 2 by 4 millimeter. And there's, um, they're lightweight, but honestly, if you would use these as little spacer beads, and I like them because they're so tiny, I don't think you'd be able to even tell they were wood, you know? And I got a decent sized drill hole, so maybe I could use them according. Okay. And then I got these filigree angel wings and I don't know if you saw my video my finished jewelry from the dollar bee box but we had a couple of butterfly filigree stamps and I beaded them on both sides and then I like um, sewed them together with a bead edge I don't know if it like a blanket stitch all the way around and it was it turned out really pretty so I'm thinking of doing something like that with these angel wings uh, how many five pieces and then oh here's some more buttons got them for two dollars they're metal they look like pewter these color And I, like I said, I like to use the buttons for clasps. Let 
I got some for two dollars. I got some five strand slide clasps. There's two of them, so a dollar a piece. I also got some um, acrylic pearl cabochons, 16 millimeter. These are perfect for bead embroidery. I got them for $1.50. I got these for a dollar. And then I got the um, 30 pieces of 12 millimeter pearlized cabochons. Alright, so that's my small haul from Hobby Lobby. Uh, like I said, the beads strung and two beads weren't on sale so I went ahead and picked up a few things um, I'm d going to be doing a new bead box subscription best bead box asked me if I'd like to do unboxing so I said absolutely so I'm not sure what time what part of the month they'll be sending that to me but that'll be exciting something new for the channel um, right now I'm not doing tutorials because I'm having some issues and I'm too shaky, you know, um, but I will be back with tutorials, but I will, I will be doing my monthly unboxings and designs from my finished jewelry videos also, so I won't be going anywhere. All right, thanks for watching everybody, and I'll see you in the next video.